All right, so first time doing this quiz or doing a quiz like this. I've done like the other ones before. I've done like the uh, the tier list and whatever. Tier list is cool, but this one I think is like a tournament style. Now, I did the 256 anime. I'm going to try to move to this kind of quick, to be honest with you, because that's a lot of anime. Um, I'll try to explain each one, each of my choices or whatever. But we'll go ahead and move through it. We'll see how many of these I know, to be honest. I'll play one on one round of um okay i see so i can either draft some anime or just do the whole thing let's do the whole thing let's get it again i like this that's kind of hard um i run in the kitchen uh i remember this a little bit more i'm not gonna lie to you haven't seen it this is pretty good that I have not seen this, and I've not seen this, so we're gonna just go with this one. Initial D, I've seen Hajime no Ippo. Haven't seen Initial D. Um, Fate. I actually did see this Fate. I think I did see this Fate. I just don't remember it that way. I don't remember that Midori days. I seen, I feel like I seen this, but I don't remember it. So we're gonna go here. I have seen this, I have seen the Wicked NHK. Fully cool, you Eden Zero. Um, weirdly enough, I'm, a, I'm, I'm gonna say Fully Cooly, even though I know, I mean, that's the whole fairy tale thing, and it's literally the fairy tale characters in another world, looks like. I've seen like season one, it was okay. Didn't really catch my eye, catch my eye. Fully Cooly is unique. Uh, Cabo Bebop. I don't even know what that is. Like, what? what Talk about. Um, I have seen this, and I have seen this, and you guys are gonna hate me, but I'm gonna go here. Only because I only seen the first season of the other anime, and it was cool. It was a little chill little anime. Um, I have seen both of these, and uh, mm, I literally do not remember this one that well. But I know I liked it back in the day. I didn't finish this only because um, I got spoiled on like the ending and stuff. I didn't finish watching it, so we'll go here. Uh, Jujutsu Kaisen, obviously. Lead. Never seen Lucky Star. Uh, honestly, I've seen a little bit of that. I feel like I know what this is, but I definitely want to go Saki K. But I need to see if I remember what this is. I don't think I remember what this is. I'm be honest. Okay, so we're going Saki K. Funny, funny, funny anime. Ah, uh, fire anime. I want to watch this again. How many I kill or call it a night? I need to watch this. I've been meaning to watch this for a minute. I heard it's really, really good. But tonight we're going a comic I kill. Uh, I haven't seen this one. Uh, definitely Hunter is Hunter. Um, Mushi. I, I, I remember this a little bit more from back in the day. Uh, Naruto. I mean, I like Detective Conan too, but Naruto. Death Parade, or I haven't seen this, so we're gonna Death Parade. Um, definitely not Soul Eater, not. Like, what? Um, uh, free. I haven't seen all of free. I haven't seen none of this, so I'm gonna go free. Um, let's see. I was wanting to watch this. I forgot this is even an anime. I'm gonna look that up. This looks familiar, but I can't remember what it's about. So, this looks cool. There we go there. Um, never really was a giant fan of Sailor Moon. Like, I respected it, where it came from and everything, but, yeah. Definitely the Roro Fire anime. It's a worst fruit basket. We're gonna go fruits basket on this. This was cool. We don't even run. This was cool. But, like, yeah. I think it's one of the first manga I ever, ever read or something. If I'm not mistaken. King's Game or Yuri on Ice. We're gonna go King's Game. Last week, watched it. It was pretty good. I think. No, I think. Was it good? No, it was. It might not have been good. I definitely watched it, though. I think. I never watched you real nice. But, uh, um, 
<laughs> that looks interesting, and I've never seen any of these. This is like an old school gold one. Alright, um. Looks familiar, don't remember it. Don't remember this. I don't remember either one, to be honest. Blue Lock or Plastic Memories. I do remember both of these, actually, and I think Blue Lock definitely takes the cake. Blue Lock is amazing. Dr. Stone, Time and Ashley Game. Seen Time and Ashley Game, thought it was cool. But Dr. Stone, for sure. So how fast we move to these. Ooh. Finally, one of the hard ones, I'm not gonna lie. If we talk about just straight Yu-Gi-Oh, I don't know. Because I've seen Classroom Elite, like, twice. But Yu-Gi-Oh is like a... That's like an oldie, man. That's like a... Man, you know what? Nostalgia wins out. I'm not gonna lie. I'll go watch some Yu-Gi-Oh right now. Never seen Ergo Prophecy. Definitely seen Mod. Fire Anime. Uh, Durara. What? Um, whoa, that's a good one too. Uh, cause this is a really, really good anime. But this is Yu Yu Show. Like, come on. Look, I don't want to be that Shonen guy, but yeah. Yu Yu Hakusho. Uh, Zom 100. I didn't actually finish that, and I do really like Berserk. It's kind of crazy. One of my first dark anime. I come to drive and though I had I didn't ever watch this, which I heard I was supposed to because it's really good, but I didn't watch it. Uh so we go Akuma Drive. That was great, by the way. Days. This was for sure one of the first anime I've ever saw. Um Oh, is it this is the spin-off for real gun? Okay. I didn't watch this on thing, but Black Little for sure. Chainsaw Man, Full Man Alchemist. Not really hard choice for me. Full Man Alchemist. Uh, Full Man of Panic. I think I tried to watch it, and it was just so many versions back in the day. I didn't know which one was which. So. I'm just playing, man. You're lying, April. Come on. I'm not that crazy for action. Oh, this is a hard one. This is actually a hard one. Not really, because, I mean, High School Day was good, but they only had, like, what, one good season? I watched all the Croak on the Basket. Like twice, so that's big basketball fan over here. Um, I think I tried to watch this one a lot, and I could never get into it. So we go gangster. That was a really good one too. One Punch Man, One Punch Man solo leveling. I'm gonna actually go solo leveling because just some simply because I thought One Punch Man was cool, but I don't know. Maybe just people super overhyping it just kind of killed it for me. Same with solo leveling, to be honest, but still. Uh, but we not even, um, yeah. It ain't, it's gonna get hard in a minute. These are really two good ones. 86 and, uh, Erased. These are really, I wanna actually go back and finish this. But because of that, I wanna go Erased. I watched that in, like, one night, I think, and it was great. Uh, I don't know any of these, so we'll go rainbow. Um, blue exodus for sure. Dear Gray Man for sure. Seems familiar, and the title is definitely something I think I've seen. I think that's Domestic Girlfriend. I don't really remember this one that well. So, no, Domestic Girlfriend. I didn't actually watch it, but it was, the premise was just ridiculous. Grand Blue was super funny, and I know Sawyer Online loves to be hated, so we can go Sawyer Online. Just because I, it's, it's got good seasons. Uh, this was not hard at all. See, like, one day to live season, that was it. Um, really good, a pretty good show. Pretty good show. Neither of these I've finished. We can go Love is Over, because it's just a bigger show. Um, definitely Black Look. Oh, Citrus? Is this the one with the, um... No, it's orange. I'm thinking about there with the sad, the sad story. Yeah, it's orange. Clan ad, super sad. Guilty crown, super sad. Um, good opening. On the band, I actually seen this. This was cool. Oof. Nah, this one's tough. This one's tough. I'm not gonna lie. This one's tough. Um, Dragon Ball Super had some very hype moments. Ultra Instinct, God, Beerus, and Goku, and all that. But if we don't count specifically, like, 
the movies like Resurrection of F and stuff as super. And we just counted super as like the tournament of power, really. And the Goku Black and stuff art. I'm not gonna lie, I would say I enjoy Prison School a lot more. That that anime is probably one of the funniest anime and resisted. Um Seven Daily Scenes versus the original Dragon Ball. Uh I went back and watched this on some old nostalgia trip and it was actually really, really good. And I would say this for sure, but like the last couple seasons have been bad. I think I'm gonna go ahead and still I I don't know, this is tough. But I feel like I I'm gonna go Dragon Ball. Oh, that's the uh, Reckon of Ragnarok. Rock. That was cool. Um, definitely Konosuba. I don't think I watched but one season, but it was really, really good. Haven't seen this. I'm interested to see what this is about. I've seen this. I just don't remember what it what it's about at all. But I have seen it. All the anime where they just look alike, and it's like a, I don't know. They all look like. Of course, party haven't seen. I see Baki was cool. Now we slugging through this. Let's get it. Real life for sure. I mean, most of Gundam is OG, but real life for sure. It's gonna be one of my videos coming up soon. Um, Torador. I just like the characters better. Uh, I didn't see this. Seen in like maybe two episodes of this. This is a show about the art or whatever, but well, I didn't watch this at all, so I'm gonna go with this. Terran Resonance. I think I seen Terran Resonance. I, I honestly can't tell you. Pandora Hearts. Horror Mia. Horror definitely Horror Mia. Is this what the anime I'm thinking it is? Probably not. Which is that though? I think it is the that anime. I think I think it is. Uh, Edgar was an OG. Boruto has a lot of missteps and stuff. Um, I could definitely say I remember Edgar fondly, but I'm gonna choose Boruto just because of the strength of Naruto. To be truthfully honest, if I had to choose one, I feel like it was better than yeah. Uh, my hero, Overlord is definitely something I feel like could compete, but my hero is killing it right now, and I and I've liked the series for a minute. Love plus. Definitely blood plus. Um, seen Danganronpa, loved it. That was another all nighter anime. Oh, that was the original Full Moon Alchemist. I still would have picked it. Uh, the, yeah, just not picking this one now too. I don't remember this one. Venom Saga is fire. Orange. I know you guys want me to see this to say this, but I've never seen it, and I really need to see it. Um, but I've never seen it. I'm never gonna say orange because that was a really emotional roller coaster. Nisei Koi is tough because I think I read like the ending of this. I actually read the manga for this, but Helsing Ultimate is. But to be truthfully honest, I like Helsing Ultimate, but I really like the, the TFS abridged version way better. So I don't know if that counts. If it doesn't count, then I'm gonna need Sekoi. I can't say that I really, really loved it, but I did definitely did finish it. It was one of the first manga I ever like fully finished. Dark and Black, it's a good show. Never seen it. it was, I mean, yeah, I've never seen it. Darwin's game. Um, haven't seen this one. Um, seen the series of Jason in this one. Made in the Abyss to your eternity. Two very big, like, interesting ones. I'm gonna go to your eternity. That one's pretty deep for me. Had them old school feels. One piece of ReZero. Okay. Attack on Titan, I'm Mashal. Okay. Those are the ones that are gonna be hard, dude. Those, those, those are gonna be the heavy hitters. Oh, great teacher on Azuka. That anime was trash. Bakano is highly regarded for me. Sometime rendering, shadow, shadow, uh, 
to be honest, probably should have my time rendering. Looking back on the animation, my chef look, it wasn't all that for me. Oh, I feel like a little bit of Blade Works is tough because they had some beautiful fights, and the, the story of this stuff was good too. And this one had like some trash animation all the way through, but I can't lie that I enjoyed the story way more over here. Just reading the manga and everything too. Monster Black Butler, definitely monster. Dragon Ball Z Haikyuu, this is tough. Dragon Ball Z spawned so many games, video games, but I mean, Haikyuu is one of my like top five. Gotta go Haikyuu. Ah, uh, definitely Drifters, that was a cool little anime. This little guy that's like sleeps all the time, it's not the guy that sleeps all the time. Either way, it's Bleach. Uh, I played the game, it was really fun. Let's see though. I don't even know what that is. It's definitely Edge Runners. It's the regular Face Day Night. It's definitely Fire Force. The regular Face Day Night is pretty OG at this point. Session Classroom, Kingdom, Session Classroom. Yep, definitely Magi. Definitely Gintama, what? Um, this one's kind of tough, but I'm with Spy X Family. Good, wholesome, funny show. Find a man. I remember this, I just don't remember it too much. I'm being truthfully honest with you. I do remember Hag and I, though. Ah, Taxi Fire Show. Great show, man. God Eater, I like, I like the uh, the games a lot. I'm gonna say Dolan and Franks on this one. Um, Phase Zero, My Little Monster. Phase Zero, for sure. Probably one of the best one out of the fates. Yeah, I do say so myself. Ready Girlfriend, and I hate myself for picking that. Uh, Master of Mune's comes with Revenge. I think they had a second season of this uh, come out, or they're supposed to come out. I was really, I really remember really liking the show. Not gonna lie. Psychopath and Yasha. I'm gonna go Yasha. That's just the OG. You remember, like, being on, like, uh, Toonami and stuff and watching that? Never seen Banana Fish, right? It's really good. Yeah, check it out. Never got me, though. Uh, definitely Sarah for the end. That's a fire, fire anime. That I feel like didn't get enough shine. Death Note for sure. It's gonna get hard until you in part two. So I'm guessing that's just this. I'm surprised they actually have this. I'm working on the Golden Time video and I couldn't find no clips, so this anime has lost its time. Definitely Golden Time though. OG Helsing or Slime? I guess Slime, to be honest. Definitely JoJo's, man. They gotta have each JoJo's? They didn't have each JoJo because that's important. B got a HK. I remember this. And I'm gonna be truthfully honest. I'm gonna vote for this because Tokyo Avengers pissed me off with that ending. So they don't deserve to be moving into the next round. And I remember that anime. Space Danny, Rascals. Rascals is good. Uh, Demon Slayer for sure. Fairy Tale or pa Parasite. I know you guys want to be Parasite because it's just a better complete project. But Fairy Tale is a special place in my heart, man. I'm not gonna lie. Food Wars for sure. Most your articles are good too. Another Cautious Hero. This would have been tough. Against a lot of other stuff, this would have been tough. Because I love Cautious Hero. Like it's one of the funniest anime and it had a crazy like emotional twist to it, right? So uh, I'm gonna go Soul Eater though. Because I just like Soul Leader better. I didn't see that. That's supposed to be like another thing in the Fate Saga somewhere. Right. Uh, we definitely going to Subasa. I read those books, man. 
Bongo straight off for sure. Steins Gate. Definitely Steins Gate. Um, definitely Tower again. No, 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 no. I've seen this. I'm going to go slam dunk. Alright, Nikki. I actually did like Mirali and Nikki. I thought a lot of people thought it was like, like, trash, but I like Mirai Nikki. I remember School Rumble too. And I remember it being pretty cool. Boom 2 for sure. This was a, this was an interesting anime that it needed more shine for sure. Emination Shadow. Not so Shippuden. Next round finna be tough. Oshinokoi Trigon. I'm about to say Trigon. I feel like Oshinokoi is really, really good though. Uh oh, I actually didn't like like I like the season one of this for sure. This one kinda bored me a little bit, I'm not gonna hold you. It is an OG though, so we can go Shiro. I wanna see season one, it was a good season one, season two got boring. Same thing. Kinda, yeah, same thing kinda. Are we on round two? I just get it round two. This should be easy. Um Epo or Trigun? Definitely Trigun. Or oh, it's not gonna use Henry Hard, I don't know what. I would say it's Tokyo Ghoul, but I just feel like Bungo Bungo Straight Dogs has such a solid like every time I rewatch it, I only rewatch like the first three seasons and they got like six seasons now or something crazy. But like I feel like that's like the one you choose. Um I don't think I remember either one of these. I think I remember this one. Not too much though. Cold Geass, okay, this is our one. I, it's not really hard to be honest. I really like Yu Yu Show for like the nostalgia and all that, but we gotta give it to Cold Geass, man. That anime is just insane. Uh, definitely BL's of a fire anime. They should have included more JoJo's, and then this would have been like a harder choice for me. Okay, no, I guess they're okay. They're they're saying all JoJo's then. I just noticed that because it's got like uh, all three of them it's got enemies from all three of them. So we'll just go. We'll go this. Cause I like those three JoJo's at least better than that. Definitely Soul Eater. Phase Zero versus Black Clover. Phase Zero is a more complete, like good-looking project, but Black Clover, man, it really took me by storm. I started loving it. Definitely Naruto, what? Um, uh, Bullock, for sure. This is, a, this is a good one, because I really liked the Ataxi, and I thought it was cool, and thought the twist at the end was, was kind of fire. Not gonna hold you. I think Orange was a big emotional masterpiece, though. Like, I think it was a big emotional show. I'm gonna go Ataxi, though. Something about it was just interesting. Um... This was one of my random picks. I remember this, but not that well. Saber in red. Definitely Dr. Stone. Um, that's a tough one too. Cause these are both like some kind of good underrated shows. I'm gonna go Boom 2. Cause I read the manga a little bit more on that. Uh, another <laughs> pair I didn't know. Kurokono Basque or Death Note? We're gonna have to go Death Note. Just simply out the strength there. Like, Kurokono Basque is good, but yeah, stop beating Death Note. Black Lagoon or Monster? I'm gonna go Black Lagoon. You guys are gonna hate me for it, but Monster was super slow to get into it in the beginning. Black Lagoon was cool all the way through. Sora Online or Slime? To be honest, these kind of give me like the same vibes because of the type of stuff. I have liked. I think three seasons of Sword Online. I would like probably like two seasons of Slime. So we can go to Sword Online. That's definitely Durarara. It's gonna get wicked next round. Uh, I really love this one. This is the first one, the first anime I ever like really, really watched. I think it was on Netflix back in the day. But I'm gonna go back now. That, that anime is just like special. 
Lock in a black uh bliss just of course. Funny show, but this was pretty good. I remember this being pretty good. Uh another throwaway pick. Two throwaway picks. We can go get to crown. Good opening. This is again a Mickey Mouse like he's going all the way to round three and it's not even that good. Um Magi or Golden Time. Definitely Magi, just for the stories, but Golden Time is really, really funny. Uh, Gintama. Nothing wrong Beyond the Boundary, but Gintama is just special. Um, definitely Dororo. Fire Opening and Fire Show. Come and Can't Communicate. Kind of a throwaway pick for me. Another kind of a throwaway pick for me. Oh, this one's kind of tough. It's actually more tough than you think. Like, Brotherhood is really, really great. And it gave me a lot of emotions. And it was, the music was great. Everything was great. Prison School is one of the funniest shows I've ever... If this was up against anything else, any one of them other things, I would definitely have to say Prison School. It's one of the funniest shows I've ever watched. With Full Malcolm is, man, it's just something different. Dragon Ball of Venice Soccer Season 2. I'm going to go Dragon Ball. Um, Baki, Rain and Girlfriend. Ew. I seen maybe like a couple episodes of Baki. He was like really muscly. So, we can go Rain and Girlfriend. Oh, well, I'm, I'm just really trash right now. Um, if you maybe went like season one of Jujutsu Kaisen versus this, then maybe I would have chose this. This is really good and it was like original. But season two just really just shaped this to be one of the best anime of all time for me. Definitely Yu Gi Oh! Uh, definitely real life. I'm, I'm probably gonna have a video coming out on that soon. Um, fruit, uh, fruit baskets was cool. I never end up fully watching it all the way. You know, Death Parade. Um, Demi Wonderland. I like Cowboy Bebop, but Demi Wonderland. If it had a better ending, it would have been a really, really better, way better anime. Uh, we can go full when that comes to the original. Um, Demon Slayer. I don't know why I keep I keep remembering King's Game, but not remembering like whether it was good or not. Cyberpunk. That was a solid anime. Psyche K. Uh, hard, not hard enough. Hunter x Hunter. I don't remember which one of these. I don't. Yeah, that's an ouch. This is a throwaway pick. Uh, Ronnie Kenshin. That was a, which one did I pick over this one again? I forgot. I think it's, is this the one with the guy with the tattoos and he's like, he's nerdy but he has like tattoos and stuff. That was a good little thing. I remember me just being really good too, but this is like during my like harem phase. Uh, Steins Gate, of course. You're on life, of course. Bleach, I want to say of course. That was actually kind of tough. Girl and on Mob Psycho. Whoa. That's probably one of the toughest ones in this whole thing. I really like Mob Psycho, but you gotta believe in the media, believe in you and all that. So, leveling of Food Wars. That's the Food Wars. Hi, Q. This, this is the hardest one I've had to do. Um, I'm gonna pick One Piece, but I feel like it's not. I feel like it's the hardest one for me because Haikyuu is definitely in my top five. Like it is my favorite sports anime. It to me it changed the way I look at looked at sports anime, and it's just I, I resonate with the character so much. It's an anime that allows me to see every character as like potentially like one of my favorite characters. We can go One Piece though. Fairy Tail Attack on Titan. I'm sorry, Fairy Tail. I try to drag you through as much as possible, but we're gonna attack on Titan. Um, another way pick. A lot of these pieces are funny because they could have been the ones knocking the other ones out for me. Inyasha Spies Family. I'm going to Inyasha. It's an OG. I just remember it. Waking up, watching Naraka just flex on them every five seconds. Um, these are not two throwaways. I've seen both of these and they're really, they're decent. They both had like weird endings though, but honestly, I'm going to go Future Diary. The only Franks just turned out so crazy to me. Uh, I'm going to go Boruto. 
this one's a tough one. I would go D Gray Man though, to be honest. Because I, I read pretty much all the Tower of God, so I would probably go Tower of God. If you're just going on straight anime, it would be D Gray Man. Haganai, Tsubasa. Haganai was cool, I don't remember that well. I definitely still remember this. Fire Force. Finished the whole thing, it was great. This is an interesting one, because these, these, these are two good, really good shows. I feel like Danganronpa, the first one, was really, really good. And I'm going to go there. Like, really, really good. I watched it one night. Origami. Such as Classroom. This next round is going to get insanely sick. Um, yeah, My Hero. And Naruto. Yeah, this next round is going to get insane. Shield here. All right, here we go. You got a hard round. Uh, I'm gonna go Cyberpunk. Not gonna lie, like Trigun was really, really good. But Cyberpunk was like a masterpiece to me. The music and everything was just on point. Never seen this, so this escapes by again for some reason. Um, okay, now we get hard. Pause. But I Dirara was was special. Them back in the day memories, the story is not making sense until it made sense. Black Clover, that was one of those shows where I'm just like, I hated it at first. I didn't like the characters, and then I fell in love with everybody. No Black Clover. Uh, my hero. Uh, Death Note, for sure. Oh, the original Dragon Ball. And the original Dragon Ball Z got taken out by something I really liked. Uh... Hunter Hunter for sure. Um, as a whole, nah, I actually know Odd Taxi. Because Blue X just had that little weird uh, dual season or whatever. Easy. Not easy, but easy. Come on, Kogias. Long Stray Dogs is fantastic, though. Um, Naruto. Definitely Naruto. This next round is gonna be the hardest one I've ever done. Now I've done one. This one's tough for me because I really wanted to make this go further. I just feel like Naruto Shippuden should not be like overlooked. This is one season though, and this one season is just like greatness. Um. Yeah, emotional story, but I don't know. I just really rock with Soul Leader and his designs way more. Fire Force for sure. This round ain't so hard as I thought it was gonna be. This one's kind of tough, but I would still go Food Wars. Watch way more seasons of it than the other show. Definitely Yasha. Definitely Sword Art. Definitely real life. I was a real life fan. Definitely one piece. This one's tough. Um, it's not that tough to be honest. I really do like Blue Lock. It was a fire first season. But this season one was pretty decent. Season two was amazing. Season three was pretty decent. So Fire one shot man, watch it out one night, cool. I gotta give it to Maggie though. I was gonna say Maggie. Uh, JoJo's for sure. I don't even know how this made it this far. Gintama for sure. Um, Grilagon. Um, that was gonna brotherhood for sure. Easy mode. Running Kenshin, easy mode. Yukio, easy mode. Um, not that easy, but I'm gonna go Boruto. Fuck, it shouldn't be this high, but I actually, it's not that. Uh, this one's tough. This one's tough, and I really, let's be honest, it's gonna be Attack on Titan. Jesus Kaisen is definitely creeping up there. 
Um, you're not April. All right, the hardest round. Let's see. Demon Slayer. No, easy. Started off easy as crap. Alchemist. It kind of easy. You just shouldn't have made it this long. I don't think. Um, as a better anime, I'll definitely say Edge Runners. Ah, uh, this one's now. This one's probably tough. This one's tough because Kogas is amazing. But uh, our hero has been one of my favorites for a minute, bro. Like, it's definitely delivering everything it needs to deliver right now. It's going crazy right now. I'm gonna try to avoid recency bias. And just really say Kogas. Uh, Magi is a hold over Fullman Alchemist. I don't know, man. I can. Oh, this is the right one for Malcolm's. Yeah, okay, Maggie. Um, I'm gonna go Naruto. Honestly, big Naruto fan. I like Hunter x Hunter, but at least it's had an ending. Even if the ending was not good, though, it had an ending at least. Um, Yellow in April. Very emotional show. Uh, Death Note. Just calm it like I see it, to be honest. Finally, this gets gone. About one of my favorite enemy of all time. In Tama. Real Life or Black Clover? Real Life was cool. It's quaint. It probably shouldn't have made this far, but it did. Um, This was tough. I would have to say Fire Force, I think. Because I just liked it better. But Soda Online ain't bad. Um, If we choose, like... All of JoJo's, and I think it's beat Taxi. Boruto versus the original Naruto. Finally, Boruto goes down. Bye, Boruto. One Piece, for sure. And Grilla. Okay, now we try to see. Oh, we got one more. Um, It's hard, but it's not hard. It's Town Titan. Now we get down to the degree. Eight. Gintama versus Demon Slayer. Definitely Gintama. Um, Edge Runners versus Black Clover. This is an interesting pick. Because that was fire to see. Yeah, I, there's like a lot of fire moments in Black Clover, too. Uh, definitely not just Shippuden. Green Lock is fire, though. Um, this is sad, but it's gonna be One Piece. Not gonna lie. Just too good at certain points. Definitely gonna be Attack on Titan. The heavy hitters are finally about to fight each other. Um, I like Death Note season season one way better than Your Line April. I like Your Line April better than season two. So I'm, I'm still on Death Note. Your Line Your Line April was very emotional, very like heartfelt. Uh, all the judges just is a little loose, definitely loose. All right. Naruto vs. Magi, we definitely want Magi. Alright, tough but not tough. We'll go One Piece. Uh, Naruto. It's gonna get easy. It's probably gonna get real easy, actually. Oh, man. Okay, so it's just rules on that. Okay. Uh, Naruto or Kogias? I just think Code Yes was the first anime that was like, wow. I really just need to learn something. But Naruto was the first anime I was like, wow. I really to go I'm gonna go Code Yes though. For lack of a better anime, I guess. Um, definitely in Tama. Here we go. Naruto Shippuden versus One Piece. I think this is like the hardest choice to make, to be honest. But honestly, it's just the amount of space style episodes that One Piece has, I would have to choose Naruto. Naruto has a lot of filler, but. For one, yes, if you count the filler, then yeah, it might lose to One Piece. But if you don't count the filler like it's intended to, it's definitely One Piece. I mean, definitely Naruto. Um, finally, finally, Kogias loses because honestly, Gintama is just amazing. And with that being said, you already know what I'm gonna pick, man. I really like Naruto. I got Naruto memorabilia and their stuff and everything. Cool. Gintama is the one that's gonna win. Because that is the anime that literally has brought me to the seven levels of emotions. It had, like, laugh. It made me laugh. It made me cry. It made me, like, like overjoyed. It just was funny. Bust out laughing. It's one of my favorite anime of all time. I'm not gonna hold you. 
Actually, it is my favorite anime of all time. So I knew it was gonna kind of win this this list. Um, so they're not gonna play again. Then they got like a well, you can see like the the picks. So the win rate for this was seventy nine percent. I was the highest Dragon Ball Z. I mean, it makes sense. It's all like the the bigger stuff showing in first. You don't see Gintama up here because it's not like there you go. It's not that big over here for some reason. With that being said, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe. I'm about to knock out. Thanks for watching again. And I'll see you guys next video.